How's it going, you guys? So, I was needing a flashlight, and uh, I got to looking on Amazon, and I found this Sunray L550. Um, so, uh, I like it, and uh, I think uh, I think it's pretty cool. So, uh, I just got it in the mail, and so I decided that I would do an unboxing video for you guys. So, let's, uh, let's see what we got. Okay, so as you can see, it says max 550 lumens. Runtime is 35 hours, and that must be on low. Uh, battery capacity is 2,000 milliamps. LED is a 6,500K. Handheld magnet basement hook stand. It's IPX4 resistant. That pretty much means like you can get it wet, but don't throw it in the pool and expect it to be perfect. So that's that's on that's that. All right, here's a little bit about it. it says it's made in China. Telephone number for the company. All right, if we flip it over to the back, it tells us a little bit about it. Power indicator, hook, magnet, flashlight. I think it's actually cool that it has, it also has this um, 180 flip uh, LED strip. So let's get this baby open and let's see how she looks in here. Ah, so here we are. Sunrex. There's the flashlight there. Let's see. Let's see if I can get this open in one hand. Ah, oh, oh, yeah, sorry. Feels pretty dang good, I gotta say. I mean, it feels pretty good. Let's see if it'll, if it'll rotate like it's supposed to. Yeah. Rotates pretty good. Okay, so let's see how this works. Let's see. All right, let's see. Actually, let's see. Uh, let's see what comes in in the box with it. Okay. Uh, we have charger. Charger cord looks like looks like it's a micro USB charger cord. Pretty easy if you've got most of the older older model Samsung phones and most uh, most Android phones. This will work with that. Uh, we have instructions. Looks like. Possibly Chinese on one side, so we'll fold out booklet. Sorry guys, I'm doing this one hand. So, okay. A little more about it. Specifications. Alright, it says node one, middle, high, low, strobe red off. So it's got a red light, that sounds pretty cool. Uh, Press and hold the button to exchange mode 1 and 2. Press button to turn off the light if no operation exceeds 3 seconds. Handheld, magnet basement hooks, hand safety hammer. Safety hammer? Nah. Huh. I don't know that I would... It's pretty tough. But I don't know that I would beat it on anything. It doesn't look... Super thick. I'm not sure what it means by safety hammer. But, alright, let's see how this light works. You can see the little LED in there. Magnets, but let's see if I can pick up a tool. So, as you can see, I mean, holds pretty dang good. Definitely stick there. Okay. Right, let's turn this baby on. Right, John. That's pretty good. Let's see what happens if I click it. Alright, so if I click it, it turns off. Click it again. Off, on. One. Oh, it gets brighter with one click. Okay. Let's see what that looks like when we unfold it. Alright, that's the brightest mode right there. I'm going to tell you, that's, that's pretty bright there. 
Okay. Let's see if we can get the strobe to turn on. So you hold the button down to get it to turn on. Let's see if it gets brighter or dimmer. Turns off. One light is... Oh, I see. So one click is dim. Um, second click is high. Third click is off. Alright, I'm going to hold it down now. Turn it off, see what happens if I... Alright, so, here's how you turn on the modes. So, I'm going to turn it on while tapping the button. Now, to change the mode, you go one, two, three. Oh, now we got a red light. This is really cool because I can look into this and it's not hurting my eyes. You know, so if you're in a place where, you know, it's really dark, you don't want to hurt your eyes, you could totally use the red light and you wouldn't have to worry about really too many problems with it. So, okay, and then we hit it one more time to turn it off. Okay, so let's go over that. Low, high, off, or er, red, strobe. That's kind of cool. If you're in an emergency or need something, that'd be coming handy as heck. Okay, so let's, we're going to put this little flip book out of the way. This is actually really cool, though. I like it. Pretty neat. Alright. I actually have a stream light here that is a co worker's. I figured I could compare them. Okay, so as you can see, the stream light is different. So right now I have them both on their brightest modes, and I want to take them over here and see which one looks brighter on the Corvette I'm working on. Okay, so this is the car. Let's go over here. Alright, now, this is what I'm working at. As you can see, I work at a shop, but it's pretty dark back in here, so let's see. Alright, this is with the stream light here. Looks pretty good. Uh, let's see how it looks with the uh, with the other light. Okay, so here we go. This is the brightest mode, sun ray. Alright, so I don't know. I can't really tell a difference. So there's. Alright, so here they are side by side, and the, here goes the stream light in the hole. Quite a bit with it. Let's try the sun re. Seems to be pretty good to me. I mean, I can't really tell a difference. I mean, it, it might be a little bit of a difference. Yeah, so I mean, definitely pretty good buy. Let's see how the red looks. Yeah, check that out. See, all kinds of stuff with that. So yeah, I mean, I tell you what guys, I love this thing. If you're looking for a flashlight and you don't want to spend I think the cheapest I've seen these stream lights is a hundred dollars. And this sun right here, it's under twenty dollars on Amazon. So I mean I can't think of a reason not to buy it. So I highly recommend it. And uh anyway guys, if you enjoyed this, if you enjoyed this video, if you like my review. Uh, please like and subscribe. I will be doing more of these. So, um... Hey guys, thanks for watching the video. If you enjoyed it, or it helped you, or you got a little advice from it, whichever, however it helped you, uh, give me a like. Subscribe. I am bound to do something else like this, because here's the thing. I like my tools, I like good tools, and I like cheap tools. There ain't no sense, and a tool can't make you money if you're paying for your tools. Get good tools, get cheap tools, do it right. Last thing I wanted to let you know is, I actually love this thing. Um, it says Sun Re on the Amazon listing. On the thing, it actually says Sun Rex. So uh, there's a little bit different, but it's the same. I mean, it's, it's a good product. So um, another last note I wanted to add is that the Streamlight had a magnet on the bottom like this one and it really didn't magnetize anything I took that thing and stuck it to benches tools 
it didn't pick up anything. This thing right here picked up really whatever I stuck it to. You know, I, you can stick it to the underside of a chassis and it stays there. You know, you can have it like that if you need to look up it, down in the engine bay, whatever you need to do. This is a really handy tool to do that job. So um, I recommend getting it. Again, like, subscribe, share, and um, if there's something else you want a video on, hit me up. You know, say hey. Just say hey, what's up? I saw your video. So uh, if you'll excuse me, again, I'm Cody, and I'm going out cruising. Thanks for watching Cody's Out Cruising. Have a good evening.